Digital learning materials are digitally accessible notebooks, workbooks and textbooks which help students to learn according to their abilities, give immediate feedback, make the learning process more meaningful and make the school bag much more lighter. In Estonia, according to the law, all the learning materials must be digitally available. The use of digital learning materials is not mandatory. The schools and teachers have full autonomy to choose paper materials or uh, digital materials. Teachers and pupils are much more familiar with paper materials, but during the COVID-19 pandemic, when all the schools were on distance learning, according to data, 75% of pupils basic school pupils started using digital content daily. In Estonia we follow the so-called Scandinavian model, which means that all the learning materials are being developed by publishers in the private market. We have nine publishers in the private market who are focused on developing learning materials to basic school and upper secondary school pupils. In addition to those publishers, we have a wide network of uh, educational technology companies who are offering wide and interactive study programs, games, applications and digital content to all the schools. The state regulates the private market situation by setting quality measurements. Uh, all the publishers and edtechs must order at least two reviews from different independent reviewers and those reviews must be publicly available to all shareholders. One review can be replaced with classroom testing. Largest learning material platforms in the private market are OPIC and Taskudark. The largest open educational resource platform is eGoligot translated eSchool Bag. It is funded and developed by the state. It is freely accessible to all the students, teachers and parents. They can find, use and even create different learning content. Sometimes the state must fulfill the publisher role itself. There are fields where, where the private market publishers have no interest in developing learning materials. One of those fields is uh, learning materials to special educational needs pupils. The state has been developing those materials for nearly 20 years now and more and more materials have been gradually digitalized. Challenge is to further support the use of digital learning materials. We believe that different user groups like teachers and pupils have now understood the benefits of using digital learning content.